Welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen. I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and it is Saturday so it is grocery haul day. We have a little different grocery haul today. Mainly everything is for Troy because when you see this video I am actually on vacation with my girlfriends in Hawaii. So I still have quite a bit of good food finds for you. I did pick up some things for myself prior to leaving and when I get back. So if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not, turn your bell on because we do a grocery haul every Saturday and I actually upload five videos every single week. Don't forget to check out the description box down below for nutrition coaching. Highly recommend personalized macros and calories. This is how I've lost and maintained my 140 pound weight loss as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching for accountability to ask questions or talk with me directly. Links and discounts to my favorite things, my Facebook group, and my Instagram. Definitely follow me there because that is where I'll be sharing my Hawaii trip. I will not be vlogging, so there will not be a video, but if you follow me on Instagram and Facebook, you can basically come to Hawaii with me. So let's go ahead and turn you around for this week's grocery haul. So here is my grocery haul for the week. I just went to Fry's, my local Kroger store. Most of what I picked up is for Troy while I am gone on my trip, but let me show you everything that I grabbed for the week. First thing is two gallons of milk for Troy. I'm going to be making his favorite pasta salad for him before I leave. If you wanna know what that recipe is, it is on my website. It is under Troy's Pasta Salad. It is not WW friendly, it is not low calorie, but it's really, really good. It's great for parties and events. It would be great for a Halloween party. So I needed some elbow macaroni. I also grabbed him some more chips so that he can finish up the rest of the daisy dip. I grabbed a can of sweet peas and carrots just to have as a veggie side. These were only 99 cents. We've been really utilizing canned vegetables a lot as part of our dinner side. It's just so much easier than fresh or frozen. I did grab this little loaf of take and bake Tuscan bread. It was on sale in the reduced bakery section for $2.29. I'm going to pop it in the fridge. I wasn't sure if Troy would want me to make up some garlic bread. He said he did not. So I am going to throw this in the fridge. It's great as a side or you can even make pizza on it. I grabbed quite a bit of cheese. They were actually three for seven and we were out of our shredded cheese. So I have some reduced fat Mexican blend. I got the cheddar jack for Troy. That way he can make quesadillas or anything while I'm gone. And then I also picked up some of the reduced fat cheddar. A couple other canned goods, some olives. I am actually making him spaghetti as well. So I'm going to make a big pot of spaghetti for him to have and his pasta salad. So we needed some olive. And I grabbed another can of pumpkin because I'm out. I can't believe I've went through five or six cans of pumpkin already. And I have a lot more fall recipes and Halloween recipes coming your way. So I picked up a can. These are only $1.99 a piece, which is a really good deal. I also grabbed some avocado smash, AKA guacamole. It was $1.80 and we still have some chips and salsa so I thought maybe we could do chip salsa and guac as a little snack and then of course Troy can finish this up when I'm gone and I'm almost out of cottage cheese I think actually after I have some for a snack today I will be out so I grabbed one more container we both love cottage cheese so I know Troy will eat this as well a big huge block of cheese for the pasta salad I cut this up into cubes that's one of the best things about the pasta salad and then he asked for Canadian bacon so that he can make little breakfast sandwiches on the Thomas English muffins that's one of his favorite things to do. So I did grab that. And then I also picked up some diced ham. This also goes in his pasta salad. I'm out of my regular Fairlife milk. It's a staple for me. I use it all the time. So I picked up another one. And then I'm also out of mouthwash. So I picked up a mouthwash. When I get back from Hawaii, before I go to Texas a couple weeks later, I am planning on making a Sam's Club run. So I'll get mouthwash there. So I just picked up one to tide me over. And then while I was in the reduced bakery section, I always like to pick up a sweet treat, mainly for Troy since I won't be here, but I did grab the premium peanut butter cookies. These are incredibly, incredibly delicious. Some of the best cookies I've had. And then I found these pumpkin fritters. Yes, please. So I picked those up for him. These were $3 and these were $1.71, which is a really, really good deal. Also in the meat section, I scored some excellent meat deals. That's one of my favorite things about Kroger stores is their meat deals. I just either cook it right away or throw it in the freezer. So I picked up a big two and a half pound pack of 80 
five, 15 ground beef. This is for Troy, whether I make him spaghetti or sloppy joes, he just goes with regular ground beef and it was $7.79 for 2.25 pounds. And then I saw this shrimp. This is actually from the meat counter, $5.06. These are the large shrimp. It's already frozen. So I'm not sure why it was reduced, but I'm gonna pop it in the freezer. I love shrimp. And then this was a score too, a pound of 96 four ground beef for $4.49. So all three of my meat deals, I'm just going to pop them in the freezer. I also grabbed some thin spaghetti for Troy's spaghetti. And then for produce, I'm gonna have a salad for lunch today. I have a salad bag from Trader Joe's to use up. So I saw this little mix of veggies for $1.88. It's carrots, cauliflower, broccoli. I'm going to throw that on my salad today. I think Troy will probably have salad with me. And then their berries this week are $1.49. That is a killer deal on their digital coupon. So I grabbed two blackberries and two raspberries. We both love berries. I eat berries every day, so chances are I'll be eating up a lot of this before I even leave. And then I did grab some radishes, which go in Troy's pasta salad, and some green onions, which also go in his pasta salad. Also Diet Coke, Gatorade Zero, both are in the fridge in the garage. I do not have a meal plan or a meal prep for the week. There will not be a meal prep on Monday and I don't have a dinner plan since I actually don't get back until late on Thursday and by then I'll be grocery shopping again. So I don't have any meal plan or meal prep on the agenda for you guys. So if you enjoyed the grocery haul, a Troy inspired grocery haul, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not, turn your bell on because I do a grocery haul every Saturday and I actually upload five videos every single week. I will have a lot of content going live while I'm in Hawaii so definitely make sure you're subscribed. Check out the description box for nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my favorite things and don't forget follow me on Instagram and my Facebook group to keep up with me while I'm in Hawaii. Thank you so much for watching. Happy weekend and I'll see you next time. Bye!